Good morning, my dear students. Today, I am going to teach you how to give test on Google form. Okay. Now, in your class section, you will get a link just like your attendance link. The way you get your attendance link, in the same way, you will get the class test or the unit test link as well. When you open that link, this is the kind of screen, the form that you will see on your screen, on your mobile screen or on your laptop screen. Now you can see it's last year test, computer test is there. This is written required. Required means that these fields are necessary to fill. Now the first option is email. So I hope children till now you all must have created your email ID on Gmail. Okay. So here I will fill my Gmail ID like this. Next is name. So I will fill my name. All right. Next is admission number. You must be having your admission number. All right. And this is written class in section that is 1C. So I will check this box 1C. All right. Now here you can see the next button is there. So what you will do, you will click on this next button. Now this is how your question paper will look like. Okay. Choose the correct option. It, the question paper will be of MCQ only. That is multiple choice question. And here it is written one point. One point means the marks. Okay. That means one point means that this question carries one marks. Now here the question is a mouse has a dash that is fixed to the CPU. So as per these questions, I will select the answer. Okay. Dash is placed between the left and the right mouse button. A keyboard has dash enter keys. There are dash alphabet keys. Now against each, each and every question you can see the marks. One point. One point means one marks. The question carries one marks. Then like this you will scroll down. Then next question is the dash key used to add blank spaces between words. Spacebar. The dash key make the letters appear in capital, caps lock. A dash is a blinking line on the monitor, that is cursor. Like this, you have to fill each and every, you have to select the right answer for each and every question. True and false. Enter key helps you to start a new line. True. There are three arrow keys. False. Then you have the next question. A mouse pointer always moves towards the right side of the screen. False. Which mouse button do we use to display the list of commands? So like this, you have to fill. I'm, no, I'm not going to read the questions for you. Okay, I'm just telling you how to give the test. So I'm just clicking the answer like this only. Now, last button you can see submit. So, what happens when you click on the submit button? You can see unit test 2 2020 2021. Your response has been recorded, means the test which you have given it's been recorded in the Google form. So, I hope children you must have understood how to give test on the Google form. But for that, you should have a Gmail ID. So I would request, please parents, kindly create a Gmail ID of your ward. Alright. Thank you children. Stay blessed. Stay healthy.